What's up guys, Dark Dally here playing Ghost Recon Breakpoint and today I want to do a little guide on one way that you can use really easily. It's a really easy method to get a lot of extra skill points. Now of course you spend your skill points in this skill menu here. Again, why am I not using my mouse? I always forget. And okay, so every time you level up you get a skill point. But there's another way and a really tricky way to do this and get a lot of skill points off the bat to kind of fill up some of the stuff that you may want off the bat that, that's good to have at the start of the game. Things like extra, you know, mark slots for your weapons, things like extra perk slots, I think are very important to have. Automatic marking is one of my, oh, the Sixth Sense, is one of my very favorite perks personally. Parachute's just kind of essential. There's a lot of things that you may want to grab off the start. And one really easy way to do that, wrong, sc wrong, wrong screen, there we go, is to take all the classes Okay, so it takes one skill point to unlock a class. Here you can see I'm Panther, you can see I'm Sharpshooter, Assault, and Field Medic. Now, unfortunately, of course, this is still release day. As I'm filming this right now, this is release day, unfortunately. As of now, there's no way to tell what level I am in these without switching to them. All right, so here's how you swap a class, and here's what it has to do with skill points. Let's get out of this. There's a bivouac right over here. That's why I'm kicking it here in Erewhon. Let's run over to the bivouac, and we're going to set up camp. And this is, I guess, really the main way to change your, your class. Right now, I'm, I'm Sharpshooter. If I want to change to Assault or, you know, to Field Medic or something else, I would set up camp at a bivouac, go to Tactics. Here, I can actually see what levels I am. I don't, it's odd that you can't in the screen. You can only see the level of your current class anyway. All right, so... Notice that I'm level, so I'm level 5 Panther and 7 Sharpshooter. I'm only 1 Assault and 1 Field Medic. Now here's the thing. You see when I mouse over these. Okay, so I'm currently Sharpshooter. You have the class rank. It gives you like basically challenges. Uh, it gives you objectives to complete. And then I hit level 8 Sharpshooter. And I will show you the advantage to that here in a second. Let's actually swap class just for the moment to... Just swap to Assault, which is level 1, and it may change your gear. It's going to go to... See, I went to a, a preset. Don't worry about that. Um, I'll have a guide on that at some point. So we're going to swap to Assault. We're just going to break cam. See, I'm only level 1 Assault. Let's just go ahead and leave right now. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. This does lead into skill points. This is an easy hack to get more skill points. Uh, pretty much right at the start of the game. Let's go ahead back to our pause menu. All right. So here you can see, um, well, actually, you can't see here. If I click over here, this is where I should be. You can see I'm level one assault now because I just picked it up. Now, I spent one skill point to get it. These objectives. So it says kill enemies with a firearm. Five. Kill five enemies with a firearm. And then kill two enemies in less than three seconds. That's it. And then I rank up assault. And when you rank up a, a, uh, a class, and this is the point, it gives you a skill point. So by spending only, you know, four skill points off the start, you can pick up all four classes. You can swap between them at Bivouacs, which I recommend doing anyway, so you get to learn how to use that class, you know. And as you rank them up, and it's super easy, I recommend ranking every, every cl class is pretty easy to, to get to at least six. Now, that said, uh, rank six, pretty easy. The, the challenges don't get in start, they don't start really getting hard until, you know, seven, eight, nine. That's when they start getting harder. It's fairly easy to rank each one up to like five or six. It really is. Now, we're currently assault. Okay, so if we hit click details, this is, okay, so every time we rank up, we get a new perk, which also helps us, so long as we're running that class. So long as I'm running assault, once I hit rank two, I'll have, you know, plus 50 maximum health, plus 10% injury resistance, plus, I mean, uh, Assault just comes with its own perks anyway, but what I mean is, uh, not perks, but, you know what I mean, not 10, yeah. So every time you rank one of these up by completing these challenges, well, show me the ones for two, not till I get there, it won't. Skill point, skill point, skill point, skill point, skill point. And it's pretty easy to do the first six. So that's one great little hack to um, spend four skill points early on in the game and come out, let's say you do each one to level six, you come out, um, so you spend four, you get 24, so you come out, that's a pretty easy way to get 20 skill points just right there. Just leveling every class to level six. 
which is really, I would say, recommendable anyway, because you learn how to play the game better when you play different classes. All right, I'm going to go ahead and rest back here, and I'm going to change back to uh, Sharpshooter. So, guys, that's a really easy hack to get some good skill points, quick skill points right off the bat, and I think, um, I think I pretty much covered the basic things, if you didn't know, that you may want to know about classes. So, over here, we're just going to click this and switch back to Sharpshooter. We're going to break camp. Do keep in mind that every time you swap class, it saves whatever gear you're wearing as the current loadout for that class. So sometimes swapping a class may change your gear. Um, and we can talk later about how to like customize that, optimize that, and things like that. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. There's an easy 20 skill points right off the start of the game. You can see that 20 skill points goes a long way. In fact, yeah, as you can see, so I, since I have two classes at level one, I can expect like another 10 or so to distribute. Now, a lot of these skills do cost multiple points. For instance here, this one costs four points. This one costs four points. This one costs two points. So, you know, having those extra skill points really can help you out. Guys, I hope this was helpful. I hope this guide was helpful. Again, check in the description below to see the rest of my Ghost Recon Breakpoint tutorial guide uh, videos in the playlist. There's a whole list of them and I'm trying to get them you know, to really walk new players through everything that I can. Guys, thanks so much for watching. I'm Dark Dally. I will catch you guys next time.